We're in Cincinnati, home of the Cincinnati Bengals at the Concrete Jungle. You know, people say this town is a real hellhole. <laughs> they couldn't be more right. You know, my Goober driver almost fell into this giant sinkhole on the way to the hotel. It don't surprise me. One of Satan's favorite cities to hang in. Makes sense he's got his own highway to hell, right? Today's matchup promises several times and ruined careers. The Baltimore Razors battle. The Cincinnati Mangles. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. And MFL Game Day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow and my partner Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. Heard you got a little touch of the mutant bird and pig flu. How you feeling, partner? Well, uh, the projectile vomiting finally let up, but uh, the monsoon mudslides have begun. <laughs> if you know what I mean. I've been, oh. I've been literally cramping his brains out all night. He's getting stupider by the hour, if that's even possible. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. He's toast. And that'll be second down and four. First down. And the running game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. Got to keep them guessing. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. That run is good for nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and 10. Hot, hot one. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. down and eight. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. And he 
picks up eight yards on a strong run. Third down and the punter is warming up. He rifled that one in there and they come up with 10 yards on the play. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. Uh, and the defense jumps up. Now the QB has to try to run out of bounds before they get to him. Needless to say, with seven crazed defenders coming after him, and that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shot play. Yeah. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, win. they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. I don't think a few low expenses, that is. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Eight. Oh, great play. He is on that receiver like glue. You know what I was Father was a very smart man, Bricks. Very smart. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and ten. Hot one. Trying to fuck a grease football, he gets away. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. <laughs> First and eight to go. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and five. Hot. 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 Hot two. Hot. 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 And they call a ginormous dirty. And man hit jars the ball loose, and it's a fumble. That's what happens when you hurdle and take a hard hit. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Hey. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Second down and a very lot. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Third down and a pussy here. Hey, man, no 
nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? And up comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. Nice kick. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot two. And this guy runs angry and runs hard. First down. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. Uh, now that is weird side effect, Brick. Oh, he was hitting mid-hurdle and fumbles the ball. Ouch. What is this, 80s wrestling? Is that my win? That penalty makes no sense. Hey, something ain't kosher here, and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. <laughs> First and goal. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second down and more than the QB would like. One, hot two. And then Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're hands, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. And that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> Second down in a hot, very lot. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. <laughs> Holy crap, he runs straight into a mutant trap and dies. Reminds me of my breakfast cereal, the old nut crunch. That's a touchdown saving tackle right there. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Well, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Hot two. Thank <laughs> you. 
Second down in a mile. Oh, what the brutal hit! Third down and, well, good luck. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done! Boo, baby, I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Oh, with a brutal hit. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And the defense jumps off sides trying to mutilate the QB. It's not how many times you fall, it's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. Yeah, they ball wouldn't hurt either. Did somebody say cocaine? <laughs> and it's first and ten. There were any functioning brain cells before that hit. They're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Second down and ten. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. Third down and ten. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. He scores! And viewers at home, don't worry. He doesn't have fleas. He's just not a very good dancer. I have fleas, and I can't dance that good. I would uh, think it'll stay on the other side of the booth, Bricks. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Third down and three. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this. He got the ball now and is going to try and score. Nice hit. And it's 
first and ten. with the brain scrambler. And they the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this. The defense is called the ginormous dirty. Oh, he fumbled that one. Everyone highlight reel leaping over a defender, but sometimes you get hit hard and have the ball knocked. She met her head. That was uh, kind of weird. <laughs> now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitter. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's for the quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two minute drill. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. No. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Side kicks the desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a position. Stealing ain't right, Grim. It just ain't right. That's a bad kick, and it's going to cost them some yards. <laughs> the teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he... And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. Second down and nine. Hot one. Eight. And the ball is lateral to his teammate. We're talking. And he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. The QB saves some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Britch's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a compliment. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now 
go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries, makers of great killer products like Groundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. The third quarter is about to begin, and if it's as much of a blowout as the first half was, we may see a riot in the stands. Well, that's going to happen either way, Grim. It's a $1 Red Bull Crap and Vodka Jello shot day. Hey, man, I scared one with Jello. I am a hell of a shot of The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. goes for the jugular and rushes to kill the and the whistle blows the play dead along with the quarterback and it's first and ten Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. The quarterback is getting mauled out there. Third down and forever. Oh, and he just turns ginormous. Look out. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Hey, the bone thing snags. You know you play Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he... Look out, that's an all-out attack on the QB. It's not how many times you fall, it's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular, the offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah. the punt. What a pussy. Second down and ten. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. That's a gain of 10 yards. Third down and the punter is warming up. for a nine-yard game. <laughs> and they'll line up for the punt here. Nice punt. Should move them back nicely. 
They just let that one drop and play it safe, and the defense says, we'll take it. And it's first and ten. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talking to you. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Third down and eight. And that's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my powder? I'm itching like crazy over here. Yeah, man, I was hanging on the now. You know what No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. Second and three. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. The Mangles strangle the opposition and win by forfeit. Oh, that is some bloody mess they left on the field. Looks good. I'm hungry. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. An alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Hard Corporation. They get it right every up.